So the trim function Excel can help us clean our data. It actually removes extra spaces, whether it's from the front, the back, or in the middle when there's more than one space. So let's take this first name listed as an example. You see some extra space in the front. There's actually some extra space in the back, even though you can't see that. And there's also more than one space in the middle. So let's clean that up and make sure it's consistent down all the rows. So I'm gonna use equals trim, open it up, select the cell to the left, close it, and then hit enter. So I removed the extra space in the front and the back and just left one space in the middle. Now, instead of repeating this all the way down, what I can do, do is just go to the bottom right corner of this cell, double click on it, and it'll auto fill the rest of them for me. And also what I may wanna do is also copy and paste these in as values. And that's important because if you say, you know what, I wanna leave the corrected name and I'm gonna delete uh, the data that hadn't been cleaned, so I just try to delete column A, what's gonna happen is you're gonna see a reference error because the formula still exists and it's looking for the cell to the left of it. So what I can do to correct that is select the entire column by clicking B up above. And then in Windows, I can hit Control C or in Mac Command C. And then what I can do is go to the paste options and then make sure I choose paste as values. It's about the third option down. And then what'll happen is it'll remove the formulas and just leave the text. And so if I want to, I can delete the column to the left, the column that needed to be cleaned. And now I'm good to go. Thanks for watching. Now, if you want the link to the sample file used in this video, it's down in the description, as well as a link to an Excel course if you're interested.